to our 82005 if you bring us another action figure review and I saw people ask well, how I made this. I made some changes to this guy. I only took Sharpie. Let's see if I can, like, I don't know. Like, I only took Sharpie really to the chest symbol. But then I thought, hey, he looks more of a glossy black than the bluish black he was. So, actually, let me turn this light on over here so it's easier. Just, uh, Yeah, you can see it probably a little better now. But, yeah. It's more, so, I remember him being more of a gloss, like a wet black. So, what I did, I took a Sharpie and went over the entire figure. I still have it, like, on my hands and everything. So, yeah, but, yeah. I, I washed it off, but, so. Yeah, and then just... Really, I can't, I don't, it's really, really simple. All you gotta do is take a black Sharpie and just go either, if you want to do the simple way, just go over the chest symbol with it and the back chest symbol thing. That's the simple way. But if you want to go the hard and long mile way, I'll take a while, go the entire figure like I did. Like, I even did it with the head. Look how great it looks now. You, can, you can't even notice that the chest symbol is there. But yeah. That's just how, basically, I made my, um, custom Venom figure. But people thought I painted it. Did some sculpting, but nope. I just took a Sharpie. And if you want to try this, just get your Diamond Select Venom figure and go wild. Because it, it really does pay off. But yeah, um, I'll catch you guys later. And peace.